Pepsi 9072 Productions presents Columbia Logo Bloopers 8 Logo Confusion has been proven. <laughs> CBS Fox has nothing to do with Columbia Pictures. Can we try this again? I sure can do, Sam. Stop for a minute. We are not going for Columbia TriStar Home Entertainment. It is just Columbia Pictures. Let's try again. Stop these bloopers for a minute here. Who was that? It was me, Microsoft Sam. My name is, Macintosh Alex. Welcome aboard, Alex, to the crazy world of logo bloopers. Can I try out the Columbia logo and see if I can get it right? You can try it out, Alex. I am gonna let the logo nice step aside for now. <laughs> Columbia Pictures is into iTunes now. And by the way, did I hear we have a newcomer in the studio? Yes you did, Mike. His name is Macintosh Alex. I think we may get more people once we get to the next couple of takes. I only came here to join the cast. Yeah, but let's try and focus on getting the logo right. Hopefully. <laughs> No, 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 this is not WCI Home Video. It just needs to be Columbia Pictures. Let's try again. Hopefully on the next take we can get the logo correct. What in the world is a DVHS? A DVHS was a high definition VHS, Alex. I guess that means we have had something before Blu ray came out. Not THQ. Columbia Pictures is not a video game company. Let's go ahead and get that on the bandwagon. Cut. Columbia is not a BHS company. Although it did release movies on BHS, it is not the right logo that should show up. <laughs> I assume it is not Betamax Ether. I will try again. Not even MCA Video Cassette Inc. Ether. Warner Reprise Video is not Columbia Pictures. Let's try one more time. Well, our time is up here. Also, Infinifilm has nothing to do with Columbia Pictures as well. We will have to try again in a month. Want a logo to be on a Columbia Logo Bloopers episode? 
Just comment what you want to see in the comments box below.